Understanding Tuning Visuals in English Hello, everyone, welcome back to our channel, where we dive into the beautiful world of the English language. Today, we're exploring an interesting phrase that might sound a bit technical at first glance, tuning visuals. Whether you're learning English as a second language or simply expanding your vocabulary, this video will unpack everything you need to know about this phrase. So, let's get started. First, let's dissect tuning visuals. This phrase combines two words that are common in English but not usually found together. Tuning refers to the act of adjusting or optimizing something, often to improve its performance or functionality. On the other hand, visuals represent any form of visual content, such as images, videos, or any graphic display. When combined, the phrase suggests the act of adjusting or optimizing visual content, but to fully grasp its meaning and use, we need to dive a bit deeper. Tuning visuals can be applied in various contexts, from photography and video production to graphic design and user interface design. In these fields, it emphasizes the importance of refining visual elements to ensure they convey the intended message or emotion effectively. This could involve adjusting colors, brightness, contrast, or layout to make the visual content more appealing or engaging to the audience. For English language learners, understanding such phrases requires not just a literal translation but also an appreciation of the context in which they are used. Tuning visuals goes beyond mere technical adjustment. It's about enhancing the viewer's experience, ensuring clarity, and sometimes it's about storytelling through visual adjustments. Let's see tuning visuals in action with some practical examples. In photography, a photographer tunes visuals by adjusting exposure and color balance to make a sunset photo look more vibrant. In web design, a web designer tunes visuals by optimizing the layout and color scheme of a website to make it more user-friendly and aesthetically pleasing. In film production, a film editor tunes visuals by enhancing color grading and applying filters to set the right mood for a scene. These examples show that tuning visuals is a crucial skill in any field where conveying messages or emotions through visual content is key. And there you have it, folks. We hope this video has shed some light on the phrase, tuning visuals, and its significance in both language and various creative fields. Remember, learning English, or any language, is not just about words and grammar. It's also about understanding how phrases can reflect specific actions, concepts, or techniques in different contexts. Thank you for watching, and we look forward to bringing you more insightful content. Keep tuning into our channel for more English language learning tips. See you in the next video.